What's up, everybody? Welcome back to our back with Chaz. Today, you guys, we are doing some Jamaican jerk root beer chicken. We have some bacon here. We got some little finger pieces there that I'm going to use today and do some cutting with. We also got the drumsticks right there and some wings. We got Sweet Baby Ray's, the Bushers Original, the Outback with Chaz All Purpose Seasoning, the root beer soda, cut green beans, the W sauce, and the Jamaican jerk seasoning. So with that, we'll be back here in a minute. We'll get this fun time smoke started. Back in. Right, we're gonna attempt to use these little shields here that my wife got and see how they work. Not bad, not bad. So, babe, I did it. <laughs> this is what they look like on your finger. All right, back in. All right, guys, I'm back in. As you see, we got the bacon going now. We got our dipping sauce on for right now. There are the green beans. And here are the baked beans. So, we're going to go ahead and get this chicken seasoned up. And we'll be back here in a minute. And we'll show you that, too. Back in, I'm back. I'm gonna lightly sprinkle this out back to try our perfect seasoning on all the chicken. So I'm gonna mainly cover it with the um, Jamaican jerk seasoning. So I'll come back just to let you guys see that I'm gonna lightly sprinkle some of this on there. I'm gonna hit it with the jerk seasoning. Here in a minute, once we get it all covered, and we'll show you the rest. All right, guys, I'm back, and as you can see, we got all the chicken seasoned up. We got it covered up with the onions, so we're gonna let it sit here for about 25 minutes, and then we're gonna go outside, light the grill, and get this fun time smoke started. And I'll come back and show you guys how the other food is coming along. Back in a minute. All right, guys, I'm back. You see, we got the last of the bacon on. There's our dipping sauce over there. For the baked beans, we added a little brown sugar and some butter. And here are the green beans. You see, I put the bacon in there, a little butter in there. All right, this is about done. We're gonna go ahead on and get outside and light the grill and get this fun time smoke started. Back in a minute. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to Outback with Chaz on this windy, cloudy day. But hey, rain, sleet, and snow, Outback with Chaz is going to bring you that fun time smoke. So if the camera is kind of moving a little bit, guys, it's due to the fact that it's awful windy out here today. But hey, as I stated earlier in the video, we're doing a Jamaican jerk root beer chicken. So with that, we're also doing a dip that I put the root beer, Outback with Chaz on purpose seasoning, the Jamaican jerk seasoning, onion, and lemon into a dipping so we can dip it and put it on the chicken instead of using apple cider vinegar for today. So with that, we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna get our prayer in. I wanna thank God for waking me, blessing me, keeping me in my right mind, giving me my health and strength to come forth today and bring you guys another fun time show. So we got the grill, it's lit, it's right about 275. We're gonna go ahead and put the meat on. And I'm gonna come back after the been on about 15 minutes and let you guys see how we got it on the grill. All right guys, back in a minute. Right, you guys, the meat has been on about 15 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and I flipped it over already. You see the color on it. It's got a little char to it on that side. So we're gonna mop some of these. Where are we gonna mop them all? <laughs> Let's see how this works out for us. Dipping a little mop in there. We're cooking this direct today, straight over the coals. I'll probably end up moving the mop sauce over just so it don't blow the ash up all in my face like it just did. You guys can see, this is looking pretty good. All my onion then fell off now. Hey, that's okay. This is what I've been wanting to do a long time, guys. <laughs> and I just never took the time out to do it. 
All right, we got it all mopped. Back in a minute. All right, guys, I'm back. We're gonna flip the meat over, so we're gonna go ahead and put some of this mop sauce on the side that slipped over, and we're gonna check on the meat and see how it's turning out. We're right about 225 now on the grill. Look at the color of that meat, y'all. Move the camera down so y'all can see that. Looking good. So we're gonna go ahead and put some of this mop sauce on there. Windy out here today, you guys. It's pretty windy. Look at the color of the chicken. It's cooking good, you guys. All the onion just came off, but hey, it's all good. All right, you can see, got it mopped. In a minute, come back, y'all. I had to come back and let y'all see this meat, man. Look at this meat. Look at it closely. That's a nice color on there, you guys. Root beer, W sauce, Outback, which has all-purpose seasoning, lemon, onion, and we've got some uh, Jamaican jerk seasoning in there as well. So with that, I'll be back here in a minute, guys. All right, guys, I'm back, and we're gonna do a little bit of a smoke talk, but. Just for you guys to know, I am cooking today right around 250, 275. We put the meat on the grill, it was right at 275. I had to put everything on there so that dropped the temp to about 200. So when I showed you guys me putting it back on or looking at the food within the 15 minute mark, that was because of the fact that the temp had dropped and I had to grill open for a little bit of time. But with that, we also did some baked beans. We put some brown sugar in the baked beans and some bacon. And we did some cut green beans that we also put bacon inside of as well. So those two items right there will be our sides. So with that being said, guys, we're gonna come back to team this front time smoke. We'll be back here in a minute. All right, guys, I'm back. And I want to come back to let you guys know that one of my day ones that I presented a bottle of seasoning to, um, actually used it and he used it besides just grilling with it. He put it on some other food that was in, he was doing inside the house. So I also wanted to say thank you for that B&BQ. T-Dog, I appreciate you. He sent a picture of some chicken wings that he'd done. He asked me what did I prefer, wings or ribs? And I said, do some wings this time. He did ribs before. So I appreciate the picture. I'm gonna put that up and let you guys see. Check on the meat. Look at the color. Look at the color. All I used on there was Jamaican jerk seasoning and the Outback which has all purpose seasoning. And then we made our little dipping sauce here that had the Jamaican jerk seasoning, the Outback which has all purpose seasoning, onion, lemon, and W sauce, and root beer. That's it, you guys. And look at the color of these wings and these drums. Look at them. Let me get a little closer so y'all can see real good. I like that color, y'all. Stop playing with me. All right, guys. We're gonna get ready to move these off to the side. We're gonna sauce them up with some sweet baby rays, and then we're gonna let them just sit on the grill and finish out their cook smoke with our offset smoke. Back in a minute. Guys, I'm back. I don't know if you can hear it or not, but it is now raining. So we're gonna go ahead and check on the meat and see how it's looking. That color, y'all. Look at that color. Y'all tell me what y'all think about the color of this chicken. Get in that comment section and let me know. It's turning out real good, you guys. I'm, I'm kind of amazed. This was actually an experiment. <laughs> but hey, it's turning out good. All right, y'all. Jamaican jerk, root beer chicken. Back in a minute. All right, guys, I'm back. And we are on the final stage of the Jamaican jerk root beer chicken. We've got it all sauced up now with the Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce. Look at it, guys. At first, I started not to put it on there, but I was like, hey, that's a part of the video. So I went ahead and sauced them up. But look at the color. Look at that color, you guys. All right. 
back in a minute, guys. All right, guys, this is how the final look of the chicken is. We got the baby, three baby raised barbecue sauce on there. And so we're gonna go ahead and take these off, put them in a pan, take them in the side, and I'm gonna taste test one of the drums and let's see how they turn out. But as you can see, if you can see, it's raining. Don't know if y'all can see that, but it is raining out here now. So with that, we're gonna go ahead and get these off. Do the taste test inside side and close out the video. Back in a minute. All right, guys, we're gonna close out the video from the outside. It is now raining outside and it's kind of thundering and lightning. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the food inside. I'll do the taste test in there. So if you like the video, you guys, hit that like, share, and subscribe. Remember to follow me on Instagram without back with Chaz, TikTok without back with Chaz. I wanna thank each and every one of you who has been supporting me thus far on my journey. I thank all the new subscribers who have come aboard. I hope you guys are enjoying the videos. And with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next video. And thanks for watching. Look at that, y'all. Looks good. Later. All right, everybody. This is the final look of all the food. There's my plate. There's the chicken. The drumsticks and the wings. There's the baked beans bacon and there are the green beans with the bacon. Alright, we'll come back here in a minute and let you guys see me and I'm going to taste test one of the chicken wings and see how it go. Back in a minute. Alright guys, we're getting ready to try the, the drumstick out first. Then we're going to taste the cut green bean for the bacon and then the uh, baked beans. So let's go ahead and try this leg out and see how it tastes. That's good, you guys. Let's get these green beans now. So far, so good, guys. So far, so good. This is good, you guys. So, this was another experiment I wanted to do to make a dipping sauce, and I actually did that. So if you guys like the video, hit that like, share, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Later, guys.